This is Pastor Steve, and this is Salter for Lent. Throughout history, church finds Psalm as a source of renewal and revival. During the season of Lent, let the praise and praying of the Psalter be the Word in Jesus Christ. Today, I have a privilege of welcoming Nancy Heaton, who is the chairperson of the community engagement at Poundridge Community Church. Would you join with her? Psalm 19. The heavens are telling the glory of God, and the firmament proclaims God's handiwork. Day to day pours forth speech, and night to night declares knowledge. There is no speech, nor are there words. Their voice is not heard. Yet their voice goes out through all the earth, and their words to the end of the world. In them God has set a tent for the sun, which comes forth like a bridegroom leaving his chamber, and runs its course with joy like a strong man. Its rising is from the end of the heavens, and its circuit to the end of them and there is nothing hidden from its heat. The law of the Lord is perfect, reviving the soul. The testimony of the Lord is sure, making wise the simple. The precepts of the Lord are right, rejoicing the heart. The commandment of the Lord is pure, enlightening the eyes. The fear of the Lord is clean, enduring forever. The ordinances of the Lord are true and righteous altogether. More to be desired are they than gold, even much fine gold, sweeter also than honey and drippings of the honeycomb. Moreover, by them is your servant warned. In keeping them, there is great reward. But who can understand one's own errors? Clear me from hidden faults. Also, keep your servant from the insolent. Let them not have dominion over me. Then I shall be blameless and innocent of great transgression. Let the words of my mouth and the meditation of my heart be acceptable in your sight, O Lord, my rock and my redeemer. Thank you.